Hi y'all. Y'all asked me to do a little video on how I make my alcohol ink flowers. So I um, have a makeshift tower here to hold my camera on a paper towel roll because I don't ever do videos. It's just a little tile. Get them at Home Depot for like eight cents. Clean. I have alcohol in this fancy little applicator bottle with a needle. And then I have all my alcohol inks. So you get to pick whatever color you want to play with. Okay, real quick. So I'm gonna do indigo. Very pretty color. And I put it in the middle, make a little circle. And I'm done. <laughs> and then I use just a regular old airbrush with nothing in it, just air. And I make sure this dries. You can tell when it's dry because it kind of gets matte. Then I take my happy little alcohol and I put a dot in the middle and then I blow. And a dot and you blow. So I'll do this real fast. Not spend a whole lot of time. So you can see how the petals are forming. My hand might be in the way part of the time, but... No, you're fine. Ivy's my little commentator. Hello, everybody. You see how big and ugly that one looks? Well, you can fix it because it's alcohol ink. You just keep blowing over. And the white in the middle is because I'm blowing all the ink out of the way. So if you accidentally get too much out of the way, I'll show you what I'm going to do here in a minute. I know my hand is in the way. And you just keep doing this until you build the petals the way you want. And the noise in the background, that's mom's little compressor. That's the air compressor. I don't like the way that right there looks. So I'm gonna try and fix it. And then look, I got way too much white. So, I know this is not the right, this is a different color. This is sapphire blue. So I'm gonna put a little of that in the middle. It looks like you already put some to the back. Dry it. Yeah, that indigo color turns from blue to purple. But it's not color changing. No, it's just, that's just the way the inks are. And then I'm gonna attempt oh. to cover up my boo-boos. And y'all are going to be like, oh my gosh, that's so easy. And it is. You just got to get practice on how you want your petals. Okay, so here's a quick one that's almost done. What? <laughs> What did you say, Ivy? <laughs> I didn't say anything. Well, don't. Okay. So let's just say I'm done with my happy little flower. Just to give you an idea. Now what are we going to do in the middle? Okay, so what I do in the middle is I take usually a black. Where's my black? The pitch black, pitch black. I want pitch black. It takes a long time. Yeah, I got all these inks. It's hard to find what the heck I'm looking for. Okay, come on, Ivy, find my black. I'm trying. And then I have a little palette here. That has a whole that bunch. That has a whole bunch of dried alcohol inks in it. But when you put alcohol in there, it will reactivate those inks. So you don't ever have to clean your palette. You just keep using your whatever's left in there. Okay, where is my... I'll use just regular black. 
I can't find the pitch black right now. It's in there somewhere. I bet you right when you use it, it'll be like I'll find it. Mama. So, oh, that's okay. Guys, this I is just, a good one. I just found it. The pitch black. What I tell you? That one's fun. Okay. So I just squirted some black into my palette here and I'm using a teeny tiny teeny tiny paintbrush and just kind of dabbing it on there and kind of filling in the middle. They can kind of see it because the outer is blue, but you can do brown if you're doing a sunflower. You can do gray. You can do any color. Any color in the middle. But I like to do black. On most of her And darker. then, to clean my paintbrush, I just have a little bowl of regular old alcohol. Looks like And a water. pee pad. And I just wipe it on my pee pad down here. For the dogs. So then we need to make sure that's dry. So the black is dry. And then I take snow cap, which is white. You have to shake it up, it makes a lot of noise. And I put that in my palette. Hold that. I usually have one spot for the white because it doesn't mix well with colors. Just put a couple drops. Because it's not really like an alcohol. It doesn't act like alcohol ink, so you can't blow the white out. It just kind of doesn't look good. Mm -mm. And then I do the same thing. Get some white on there and just start dabbing in the middle. This is real quick, so I'm not going to be real pretty with it. But as you can see, I don't know if you can see, mm -hmm. but the white kind of blends with the black. And makes it like a gray. And it kind of picks up whatever undertones are under that black. So right now it's kind of a purpley blue. So we do this. Put a whole bunch of dots. This is looks kind of ugly right now, but when you're done, you'd be amazed. So I do that. And you can. Don't knock over my camera, Ivy. <laughs> I'm trying not to. Because it'll break my tile. And you can find. These. Actually, this one's turning out pretty cool. You can find these alcohol links like um, at Joanne's or like at. Um, Michael's or Hobby Lobby. Yeah. Okay, now if and you. They come in three. Okay. <laughs> See how my center's looking kind of funky? Just kind of looks like a blob. Well, then I'm gonna go back in with some black to add some more black to it. And fix it up. And kind of fix it up. You just kind of have to play until you get it the way you kind of like it. I kind of like it darker on one side and lighter on the other. And then you sell it. And then you put it on Rock That Art Auction and hope somebody buys it. Okay, now I got too much black here. So I don't really like that. So I'm gonna dry it. With my happy little airbrush. Hold on, Ivy. Okay, Ivy had to zoom out. And then I'm gonna go back in and put just a little more white here and there, just to kind of break up all that blackness. This is the hard part, is trying to get the center the way you kind of want it to look. Or you could use jelly roll. Well, I'm gonna get to that too. Oh, sorry. So, that kind of looks okay. Mm, not bad. So we dry it. Make sure it's good and dry. Then I take a jelly roll, a white jelly roll, and well, let me make sure it works. Okay, it works. And then you can add little dots to kind of get the little wispies off the sides of the feathers. Feathers. Petals. Am I doing a bird or a flower? I guess you're doing both. So you can do this. Happy little dots. Happy little dots. And then you can come in here and put some more happy little dots. I'm happy with the way that looks. Then I'm going to take a black jelly roll. She has tons of jelly rolls. I have a whole bunch of jelly rolls. I kind of go to the extreme with buying something. If I like it, I have to have all of them. But you kind of don't use them. I use some. Some. And then you can go in and put little black dots. 
just to kind of break it up a little bit. You don't have to do the dots. You can do whatever you want in the middle, but I kind of like the way this is. And I've watched a lady on YouTube. That's how I learned this. I can't think of her name off the top of my hand, head. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm trying to be quick here because I got TV to watch. Okay, and then if you want to, let's zoom back in. So you can see the little dots I did on the outside. It kind of makes it have a 3D effect. You can actually draw little, the Lines. little hairs, the little tiny hairs that some flowers have. You can just kind of go all the way around. Some flowers. And then I've kind of covered up my dots, so I'm gonna put some more dots out here to give it a little more. Volume. Volume in the center. And also you can do like a whole bunch of lines and then you can like, you can go like that. Like do lines and then fill the line with dots. So I'm gonna put a little more white there. Do, 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 do. This is the easy, fun part. And you can do whatever colors that you desire. Any color you want. I don't like the way this looks right here. Let me zoom back out. This big old petal over here. So I could try and fix it, but I don't want to mess it up. What I could do is put a little drop of alcohol here and blow it out. Let's try it. If it messes up, oh well. Oh well. So I'm gonna put a teeny tiny drop right here. Blow it out. Now I got a big old white dot there. Not too bad. Mm. I've done worse. There, that looks a little better. Now, and then you take your happy little jelly roll. Black. Jelly. Or blue or purple or pink or whatever you want. And then you just sign it. I'm bada that book, bada boom. Is a quick, it still looks a little wet in the middle. Quick little video on how I do my alcohol ink flowers. I guess since I made this one, I'll have to go put it up in auction. If you have any questions, send me a PM. Thank you.